Good morning, YouTube. How are you guys? It's a little, it's a little cold this morning. <laughs> yeah. So today, uh, day off. So I'll be working on this thing. Uh, sand some more. Uh, see if I can get that other door I got put on and then just keep sanding uh, I think I need to I need to buy a couple things so I think I'm first I'm gonna run to the store so store run get some primer a couple things that I need so yeah let's get to it and obviously I can't drive this thing because uh I got no bumper rear bumper and I don't want to get pulled over so I'm taking this thing See how that cold start sounds. Yeah, cold start. <laughs> Been a while. Now let's see if we can get a cold start out of this. Fucking, I'm shaking because it's fucking cold. Yeah. Let this thing warm up a little bit. Probably move it. Uh, probably move it on this side. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that little static uh, ASMR. Yeah, I don't have the, don't have the best driveway here. Big ass hole, big ass hole, big ass holes over there. Exhaust, exhaust, mud flaps, uh, frame a little bit, branch. All right, you guys, let's go take a little slow run. You can tell it's been a while since I've driven it. I got spider webs already. It's a little chilly. It is 49 over here in Washington pretty cold so I was driving and I could hear what sounded like I had a flat tire Look at this shit. it's always on this side too that, that gets flat always this side I don't know why bitch was at two well that shit left it fucking worse I don't know if that shit debeat it or like, what the fuck? It didn't want to take any of the fucking air though. I don't know if that shit de I don't feel like it debeat it. But like, that shit was, it like, 
like more air left instead of trying to fill it up right now okay let's see if this one works yeah this one definitely works so the tire wasn't debated it was just a air machine that they didn't want to put air i guess okay so that definitely worked i also realized i left the gas cap yes there we go now we're back in business now we can go get the stuff some primer and then some sanding pads here we go now let's go All right, before we start off with any work on the car, let's kind of go over everything that the car needs or is wrong with it. So first, the engine. The engine is leaking from my rear main seal, you know, way back over there. And um, basically that needs to be replaced, so the engine needs to come out. I came across a uh, WRX turbo kit on the Facebook market. So I'll be picking that up and then take the engine out, um, fix the rear main seal, install the turbo kit on it, notch the subframe because it needs to be notched out for the for the headers, for the exhaust headers. And then this. <laughs> Brother, There's another thing that's wrong with the car. As you can see, you can see, you know, you can see through. So that's not good. So that's another thing we got to fix. I'm not exactly sure how to go about that. Because that shit's pretty bad. Or like cut and then half his shoes like re-weld something here. I don't know. We got to fix that too. And tail light, obviously we got that. The door, well, got that too. So the door, the engine that rust back there and then another thing that i wanted to do make it um this is just make it front wheel drive so the diff on it is like going out it's like it's it's done basically so diff needs to come out and then i'll remove the rear axles the drive shaft and then just leave it front wheel drive so it won't be all wheel drive no more so that's kind of basically everything the car needs and that I'm going to do hopefully this winter and then get it back up and running good, you know, for next uh, for next year, next car show season. And then hopefully have it painted, all, all of it by then too. Um, Ulises is the one that's going to paint this. Shout out to Gilly. Obviously when the time gets warmer, you know, next year more than anything and uh, get rid of this fucking nasty two-tone. But yeah, a little brief overview. We'll see if all these plans come true. This is what I'm hoping for, yeah. So enough of talk of the everything that's wrong with the car. Today we're gonna be sanding this, getting rid of this pinstripe sticker and then taking that door off and putting this one on. Got the first little pass done. That first pinstripe out. But yeah, let's keep going. This thing's pretty much sanded, you know. 
obviously it needs like more like fine fine sanding and by hand but we'll get to that once it's mounted onto the car i think we'll be able to just kind of fade this a little bit more and then paint all this like that so to get this door off i'm gonna see if i can do it by myself so we got this little pin right here and then one two three four and the pin the door comes off take these door uh door panels off put them on the other one from there i might remove this throw it away this is the, the nasty one and then i think i'm gonna take this off right here and show you guys underneath because i want to remake one of these because i need to remake it so pop that off show you guys what i did there like i made it by hand just out of sheet metal cut it up bent it took measurements the measurements is what took me the, the longest but yeah let's get to taking out this door Let me get you guys a better POV. So, I realized, I don't know why it worked at the junkyard, but this wasn't working. So, found another solution. So, basically, just take something flat, you know, like a flat surface. Now, we can get the door off. Two thousand years later. All right, finally got these bolts out. Top two. Made a little. I don't know if you guys can see that. Break something up to kind of hold the door in place. Definitely recommend um, two people for this job. And just like that, the door is off. Bit of a struggle, but you know, we got it. Looks pretty sick without the door. So, got the door over here. Now, let's put it on.
Bruh. So, <laughs> you guys saw me freaking out right there. And I was like, I closed the door and it wasn't opening. And then I unlocked the car and it still didn't open. But obviously the, the door's not gonna lock if it's not hooked up, right? So, yeah, my head's starting to hurt. So, door panel back on. Looks funny. But one more piece to the puzzle. My head is starting to hurt. I don't know if it's I'm not eating enough breakfast or I don't know my head's just hurting like crazy though but wanted to at least get the door on today you know this thing pretty soon take the engine out rear main seal turbo kit notch out the subframe um Remove the drive shaft, rear axles, diff. Fix the nasty rust. And paint it. Well, you guys, appreciate you watching. Appreciate you guys uh, always tuning into the channel, watching the videos. A little bit different video today than what I've normally been doing. Normally it's like car shows, car trucks. What? Truck shows and car shows. Yeah. Oh, well, you guys, I think I'm gonna go get some rest because my head is like just pounding right now. Thank you guys for watching. You know, just a little update video. A little working on the car. Showing some of the progress. Next year, boys. Next year. Appreciate you guys watching. See you guys on the next one.